What's poppin' guys, it's Nyla Simone, and we are live on Blends and Trends with a very special guest from North Carolina. We got two C two times in the building. Yeah, the big stuff of the well known flexor. I said it right, two C two times. Uh huh. What's the two times for? Uh two times is just the way of living. You know, you know how they say when you sleeping and somebody who working two times as hard as you mm. show if you around me. Anybody that's around me working two times as hard as the next man. And if you ain't you can't be around me. I like that. That's fire. For sure. And my father always tells me if you got one, you got none. Yeah. So two let's times go. is like come on. Yeah. <laughs> so. nah, that's a vibe. Well, welcome. Um, I know you had one hell of a year. You've yeah. uh, opened up for Money Bag, Money Man, mm -hmm. The Baby, yeah. uh, Polo G. Uh -huh. What else is What else is coming? Like, what, what can so. we expect in twenty twenty? Um, well, last year I did like four tours. In the last year I did like four tours. When I toured with Baby, yeah. Um, when I toured with Summer Walker, then I did. Well, I did the Polo G. Then I did Summer Walker, and then I did tour with Baby again. Um. This year, you know, I'm hoping to go on my own tour. You know what I mean? Fire. Might go on tour with one more person, and then I might go on my old tour. But a Platinum Heart tour sound, sound nice. Pretty fire, yeah, yeah I think so, sure. too. So, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that I'll uh, get into play. Yeah. I'm just waiting on that, you know? I feel it, I feel it. For so sure. what was it like? Do you, Are you enjoying tour life, first of all? Um, Yeah, I'll I be missing my family, though. I'm real, like, family-oriented. Okay. So I'll be missing my, um, my family a lot. I miss my nieces. So, mm. yeah, other than that. Cool. I, I love that. You bring them out? Have they came and seen like? Oh yeah, they, like they come to like little stuff though. I don't get them involved in like you know because you never yeah, know what's yeah. gonna happen, you know. So I don't, I don't even play like that. Yeah. You know, so yeah, I, I bring them to like little stuff though, like my meet and greets and stuff. I might bring them to like my meet and greets the and calm, stuff like. for sure. Yeah, <laughs> but they be turning up though. You know, they be running around lit. I mean, they want to take pictures. They want me to sign stuff like I'm not their <laughs> uncle. You're like, yo, I, li yeah. I live with you, like your yeah, family. Yeah, yeah, they crazy. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, it'd be nice though. I bring them to the one, the, the stuff that I can. Nah, that's dope. I love sure. that. Very cute. So, what, like, how did you connect with the baby? You want to tour him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, me and baby signed to the same label. You it's know, a Carolina we, thing. Yeah, most definitely. Okay. Like, straight Carolina, like. Okay. Because I'm, while well, I'm originally from Syracuse, New York. You dig? I'm from, I did. I saw that in your small eyes interview. Yeah, I'm from upstate. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I was so like, you, oh, yeah. that's so... <laughs> yeah, yeah I'm, I'm from upstate, but I um I moved to Raleigh like six, six and a half, six years ago. You okay. know, so I claim both. You know what I mean, like, I don't even play. I claim both. But um, me and Baby signed to the same label, uh, South Coast Music Group. Shout out to them. Um, And yeah, like, ever since then, you know, that's just like Big Bro. You know what I mean? That's tight. I love that. For sure, most definitely. What is something that you've learned since, like... uh? I guess like working with the baby. Um, just like work ethic, work ethic, and um, work ethic, and I can say performance. You know, uh, being a better performer. Yeah. You know, seeing how hard he worked, like he don't get no sleep. Did you perform at um the Double XL freshman concert? Nah, I didn't. You didn't perform. We, I, we, I remember he brought out like mad people. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. Yeah, he okay. probably brought he. Yeah, he. I know he brought like uh, a lot of his artists. You know, because yeah. he. I'd only his, seen because I know he did that show multiple times. Uh -huh. I had only seen one of them. Yeah, he he got like he he got a few artists. He he you know billion dollar baby they strong too. Yeah. You know I mean, so yeah, shout out to them too. Um, but nah, I I think we gonna we gonna pop up there today though. Oh, really? For sure, most definitely. That's fire. Yeah, I ain't playing. Nah, I see you moving. Most definitely. But you've been moving even prior to coming when I, like, did my research on you. Yeah. I'm like, you've really been everywhere. How could I yeah. not know? See, I'm, I'm, I be, you know, I be chilling. You know what I mean? Because I feel like the handshakes is more important. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't, my name will get out there when it get out there. Right. But when it get out there, it's going to be like, I right, like, they going to stick with me. Like, it ain't going to, you know, these handshakes was important. I, I want people to actually know me before I pop. You know what I'm saying? I feel that. Most we can definitely. definitely learn you through the music. Yeah, like, most definitely. Most now definitely. Listening. I like it. it like, it It reminded me of, like, a combination of, like, this might sound weird because they're totally opposite, but yeah. of, like, Little Baby and yeah. A Boogie. Like, yeah, at the for same sure. time. For sure. Storytelling. What is some of you your, mean? like, inspiration in music? Um, Yeah, like, inspiration-wise, artist-wise, I don't really got no inspirations. Like, okay. I don't, because I don't listen to rap music. I listen to like pop and stuff, and like people be people really? be yeah no cap like people, no. <laughs> people be surprised when I say that, but like yeah I listen to like Adele, um you know John Legend, Billy Eilish favorite Adele song uh Hello probably Hello okay yeah like cause that's that it speak to you yeah I like her I like uh Adele I like, like Jason Mraz you like soulful music yeah okay. for sure cause I make soulful music right. I mean, I make uh you know Jason Mraz, Train, like all that. I listen yeah. to stuff like that. But yours is just the rap form. Yeah, for sure. Most That's definitely. Dope. I mean, gotta figure out how to 
you know, put it Combine all together. Combine them both, yeah. Most definitely. Nah, that's cool. So you, sometimes you just need a break from that type of stuff. Most definitely, most yeah. definitely. I don't even like riding the music. Really? I ride a silent. Silent car rides? Yeah, because I, I make Y'all music. Y'all silently over here? Yeah, I have oh, my wow. headphones. Okay. <laughs> you know, like, he, he really don't, he might listen to, like, the radio. That's make it. sure it's power. Yeah, for sure, <laughs> for sure, most definitely. So tell me, what were you like growing up? Were you into school or were you not? Like, just to get to I was know bad. You. Bad. Yeah, I was bad. In the streets. Um, you know, bad. A little bit of everything. You play sports? Yeah, I did play sports. That's you play? that's like one thing that, you know what I mean, kept me. But I played football, baseball, and basketball. Oh, you played a lot of sports. Yeah, for sure. I was nice. I okay. was nice in all of them. I was averaging thirty six in basketball, starting quarterback in football, Fire. um center field, baseball, shortstop, pitcher. So then what got you into rapping? My brother was a rapper. Anything my brother did, I wanted to do. Mm. You know what I mean? So that's why I say, like, he was my inspiration. You know what I mean? He played football, baseball, basketball. <laughs> you know what I mean? Anything he did, I wanted to do. That's dope. He wanted to be in the streets. Okay, cool. That's what I wanted to do, right too. right behind him. No cap. Like, I'm out there with him. That's love. You know I mean? So, yeah, anything he did, I wanted to do. Oh, the only thing that I had learned from, like, what I had learned online was about, like, your your girlfriend or, mm-hmm. like, your girl. The girl <laughs> who cheated interview. on me? Huh? You talking about the one who cheated on me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, everybody talk about that, man. I was 15 when that happened. Oh, really? Yeah, I was young. Oh, that's, but I don't know why it seemed like yeah, it was that recent yeah, yeah, in the Yeah, nah, I was, because I was, the small eyes drunk, but nah, I was I was young. I was young and in love. Oh, okay. For sure, but she, not a, she ain't a bad person. Not a bad person. Nah, not so at all. So what's up with this broken heart on your face? Um, You know, it just symbolizes everything that I've been through. I mean, I got two tattoos on my face. I got a tattoo right here that say empath. You know what an empath is? Empath is people that feel sorry and like uh-huh. always want to care. For sure, like, for sure, yeah. for sure. You you, you know something. Because you know I mean? think I'm an empath most, and most I have definitely. dealt with a narcissist. Most definitely, yeah. yeah. So, so, so yeah, I'm, a, I'm an empath. Um, And then I got the broken heart just it's for... It's a beautiful thing, though. Most definitely. Yeah, it okay. is, it is, it is. You know, Um, but the broken heart just stands for everything that I've been through. I mean, not, it ain't a broken heart from love. Okay, right. that's what I, that's why I thought back to the clip, nah, like, dang, nah, you really nah. went through it. Nah, I'm nah, not. Nah. <laughs> hey, but you know, a lot of dudes get their heartbroken. Like, a lot of dudes get their heartbroken around that age, like around 16, 15. A lot of yeah. dudes been heartbroken, and that's why they're like. Never they, recover. Yeah, yeah, never recover, like, for real. But, but nah, you recover. Most definitely. You wholesome. Man, I shake back okay. from everything. That's good. That's shake dope. back from everything. You got a lot of tattoos, your whole neck covered. It look like I got a lot. It, it does from this. Yeah, nah, I don't, though. I only I got uh, an eye on my neck for knowledge, wisdom, and power. Um, I got the two times, you know. Told you what, the, what that means. Got um, it. This, this. I got like uh, the Statue of Liberty because I'm from New York. You oh yeah. So that's you know that's the biggest symbol of. I ain't want to get. I could have got the Syracuse orange. Cues, right, yeah. Orange. I ain't want that. Um, Syracuse having some racial issues anyway. You don't need to yeah, tap like, into that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm cooler. Um, yeah, and then. I got a tattoo right here that say pray for me with praying hands because I'm big on prayer. Nope. Um, tattoo over here that's a tattoo of me with a mic wrapped around my hand, spotlights, and, you know. I, the vision. But I got like seven. I don't really got a lot. Oh, wow. Yeah, it look okay, like cool. I got a lot, though, huh? I like, it does. Yeah, that's how but I that's want it to be. But that's because you got on this bright jacket sure, and sure. chain. That's, that's, how, I, that's how I want it to be. That's how I want it to be. I really like this uh, the drip you got on. Oh, yeah, I be dripped out, draped out. You know what I mean? Oh, oh. You I, be, to... <laughs> I, be, I, I be dripping. I be chilling. Nah, it's fly. I like, what type of jacket is this? Uh, This is, uh, what, what's the name of this? What that say on the back, Flip? Sugar Hill. Sugar Yeah, dope. so shout out to them. They sent me this. And then, you know, I got the vape up under because I'm a uh, vape stuff. I mean, I like bait. Yeah, me too. For sure. That's so, dope. yeah. That's dope. Other than that, I be chilling, man. I just get dressed and I come outside. Comfortable? Are you big into, like, fashion, though? Yeah, that, like, I am. Thing? I am. Always have been? Yeah. Yeah. I be fly. You got to look at my page, man. I be, I be driven. So, what are some things that you plan on getting into outside of rap? Um, Movies. I want to do movies. You want to act? Most definitely. Really? What's I your sign? I want to do everything. I'm a Capricorn. Oh, okay, okay. Most definitely. I just turned 20. Um. Okay. Like, like what was it? Three weeks ago, maybe four, four yeah, weeks ago did, now. Caps. Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. I just turned twenty, so um, I mean, I want to do acting, um, in real estate. Other than that, I'm cool. I don't want to do nothing. Real estate is the best way to be rich, right? Most definitely. I'm trying to get into definitely. that too. I want to do acting in real estate. Fire. I want to own like um, I want to buy some condominiums. Mm. I mean, I thought about triplexes, duplexes, but. I heard when you uh not renovating one side of your triplex and your duplex, you lose money. I mean, mm. I don't know if you, I don't know. You're if you, not that, into that, that part. You know, that's, that's you know, that's a little bit of. You know I mean, free game for anybody that's out there. Yeah. You know I mean, 
think about condominiums and automated parking lots. Automated parking lots, you know, just so my money could sit. Actually, that's very smart. I want a laundromat. So Definitely. Okay, so you know something. <laughs> yeah, for sure. For I sure, want a laundromat. Sure. Smart investments. There's a whole lot of things you could invest in. Yeah. For sure, most definitely. We get there. 2020, we're going to get there. Yeah. But uh, let's talk about Platinum Heart. Uh-huh. What was your inspiration behind this project? Um. So, Platinum Heart, uh, the name came from, you know, I got a saying that, and it go like, keep your heart. And what I mean by that is, always treat me how you treated me the day you met me. You dig know what I'm saying? Um. Mm-hmm. I don't care if you got a bad vibe from me, whatever it is, because if I get a bad vibe from you, that don't don't mean I'm going to treat you wrong because I'm human. Right. You know what I mean? I could be wrong. So um, I got to say, and it's like, keep your heart. And what I mean by that is, like, you know, just treat me how I treated you and all that. So I always felt like I was going to be a platinum recording artist. Even if my songs wasn't platinum five years ago and they wasn't good, you should have seen what I seen. You know, you should have had the vision that I had. So my, I feel like my heart was platinum before my music was. Fire. And, you know what I mean, that's why I named it Platinum Heart. But the whole, the whole album, except for like maybe like two, three songs, maybe like, maybe like a song actually. The whole album, except for like one song, came from my bedroom. You know what I mean, like I recorded the whole album on my bedroom. Oh wow. Yeah. So like, it, I don't know. It meant a lot to me, and I recorded it in like a month. Like I had a whole bunch of songs. I probably got like close to a thousand unreleased songs but like i just i don't know i locked in a room and i recorded that in a month and i was like all right we gonna go with these ones like, forget everything else and just telling your story most definitely i mean now we now we what number five most most purchased on itunes uh, top 20 apple music that's dope you know i mean no 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 major label though is there like a lot of people that didn't believe in you most it, definitely yeah, yeah i told my football coach that i wanted to make music he laughed at me mm. yeah i mean and then i got booed off stage at the a boogie concert like two years ago oh wow for sure but that's what i mean i shake back like i mean I don't, stuff don't bother me i take the good out of everything i'm a positive person yeah that's fine and you know most what Drake got booed like three months ago so yeah right it happens to one everybody. of the biggest artists in the world yeah you know like I mean? For sure. So like I, yeah, I, stuff like that never really get to me. Yeah. Like it ain't. It's it's probably nothing you could say to me that are like really like bother bother me. That's good. That resiliency sure. is gonna get you so far. Yeah, That's dope. Most definitely. I love it. Platinum Heart out now. Yeah, for sure. Um, shout out your Instagram. Let everybody know where they can stream your music. Yeah, it's the big step of the well known flexer, T O O S I I two X, and you can follow me on all social media platforms with that at name, T O O S I I two X, two C. 